and welcome to my home sweet tent for the weekend. Come on in, I'll show you around. sticking so I don't sleep on the ropes because that's not fun. And then here are the ropes. It's in a diamond shape. Um, but that's the way it's strung. You can see the ropes here and on the side here. This is our little broom. We used to sweep out all of the little grass and hay that gets in. And then we keep everything that we don't want seen under the bed. So this is my newest prized possession. Uh, it is an antique trunk from the best that we can tell. It's from right after the Civil War Reconstruction era. It is in fabulous condition. I don't take antiques out unless I know they're sturdy um, and can handle it. Because we, I just retired my old trunk because it's from the 1870s and it was starting to not not be able to handle the reenactment climate. And we always are very careful to stay in the tent on the ground cover, on the canvas, cover them at night and stuff. But you know, what's the point of having an, a nice antique if you're not going to use it? You know, they're great to stare at, but sometimes it's nice when they serve a function. So that one has been retired to indoor storage, and this one has just taken up the new commission of reenacting. This is where I keep all of my clothes. And it's wonderful because it has this nice little top drawer that I put all my accessories in. And then this pulls out, and then you, I have where I store all of my clothes. And they're all nice and folded up here. Mine are on this side, my mom's are on the other side. Um, and that's where we keep all of our clothes. I then have a carpet bag where I keep all of our underpinnings so that we can keep those separate. So, yep. So, it just sits down there nicely. It's a nice camelback trunk here. I have another couple little uh, metal boxes where I have all of my like nice little jewelry accessories. And this is where I keep like the fans and the belts and my mirror that I look at to make sure I don't look extremely terrible because I can't see myself half the time <laughs> when you're reenacting. There are mirrors everywhere. But at least before I step out of the tent, I think I look decent. But yeah, so that's pretty much our tour, tour of our tent. We have a nice canvas ground cover here and then we put a rug on top of that. We're up on civilian though, so we don't really worry about military regulations. Society ladies 